Book The Chalk Man by C. J. Tudor Prologue The girl's head rested on a small pile of orange and brown leaves. Her almond eyes stared up at the canopy of sycamore, beech and oak, but they didn't see the tentative fingers of sunlight that poked through the branches and sprinkled the woodland floor with gold. They didn't blink as shiny black beetles scurried over their pupils. They didn't see anything any more except darkness. A short distance away, a pale hand stretched out from its own small shroud of leaves, as if searching for help or reassurance that it was not alone. None was to be found. The rest of her body lay out of reach, hidden in other shrouded spots around the woods. Close by, a twig snapped, loud as a firecracker in the stillness, and a flurry of birds exploded out of the undergrowth. Someone approached. They knelt down beside the unseeing girl. Their hands gently caressed her hair and stroked her cold cheek, fingers trembling with anticipation. Then they lifted up her head, dusted off a few leaves that clung to the ragged edges of her neck and placed it carefully in a bag, where it nestled among a few broken stubs of chalk. After a moment's consideration, they reached in and closed her eyes. Then they sipped the bag shut, stood up, and carried it away.